Hey there, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Spyro Reignited Trilogy. Well, time to go ghost busting in the haunted towers. Let's also be on a lookout for that uh, hidden blue hat somewhere in this place. Oh my gosh, I keep looking at those green like things at the base of those uh, like designs, like what are those things are. I keep thinking they're emeralds. <laughs> Yeah, the Super Flame lets you instantly destroy those uh, gym containers and things, too. Spyro. All dragons know there's magic in a fairy's kiss. See what it can do to your power of flame. <sighs> Little late to be telling us that. Considering you literally have to do that to even be able to reach here. your horns here comes Spyro patience little one you'll soon have the opportunity to battle the one who matters most nasty Nork
wonder where that hidden cap is anyway. It's probably it's probably in the secret area of the level. I'm speaking of that secret area. Let's make our way there now. Man, I remember back when I was a kid playing this game. This place eluded me for so long. To be honest, I don't even remember how I found it. I I either checked online, like when I finally had internet access, or like someone at school told me how to get here. But yeah, this is without a doubt the most, like, secretive thing in the entire game. At least as far as, you know, the original Spyro goes. I don't know about some of them new things they added to this game, like... The secret room in Dreamweavers. Like, is that even a thing that was in the original? Because I don't remember anything about a secret room. Like, if it existed, then I never knew about it. didn't quite make it. Not an easy supercharge to make. Oh, freaking great. Well, we get an infinite super flame at the end of this level, so, uh, or rather in the secret area we do. Assuming they didn't change that for the remake, so... I'll just worry about destroying the rest of them armors, like, at the end, after we go through the secret part. There we go. I don't know why I flame that. You've become a master of the supercharge. Great work. Oh yeah, this room got a race to the top. Infinite Super Flame is a go. Yeah, it's infinite. So yeah, I was gonna guess that if that secret uh, wizard's hat was anywhere, it would probably be in this room somewhere. Alas, it would seem it might not actually be. Hmm. Ah, 
I gotta wonder if it's in a reasonable location or if it's literally just like floating up in the corner of some room or something. I mean, this is Dreamweaver, so technically, you know, nothing would really be out of the question. Oh, well, I just, wait, I just realized, the Super Flame actually changes Spyro's design. That hadn't actually jumped out at me until now. Alright, well, I'm gonna go try to find that wizard's hat, then. Well, actually, no, we should first go to the end of the level, at least. Well, there we got the achievement for destroying all the armor enemies. Wizard hat. Okay, so... It's gotta be somewhere. You know what I bet? It's probably hidden up in one of these little windows somewhere. In the level. That's probably where it is. You know, something I've noticed about all of these is that all of the things that were in the environment that you had to burn, it, it, it says they're hidden. But the blue wizard hat, it doesn't say anything about it being hidden, so I'm thinking it might actually just be the most obvious thing. Not sure if this is something you can actually do, but... Oh! Wait... I don't understand. Like, is there some way that we can actually burn the hats while, like, leaving them alive? Like, maybe you have to be under the effect of Super Flame? Or what if we were to charge through them first? Okay, I have no idea. Okay, so I checked the uh, message board and... Well, apparently there is a hidden ledge somewhere with a blue wizard hat on it. I have no idea where it is. I don't intend to look for that. Now I know what I'm looking for, so... Yeah, apparently you need to glide to it, so it's... Hmm... 
Hmm. I got some ideas about where it could potentially be. Yeah, it's definitely not around there. Oh yeah, I could have looked back there and saw that there was nothing to glide to. Okay. There's actually very few locations that this thing could actually be at. Okie dokie. So yeah, if it's anywhere, it would probably be over here. And that's a negative. Let's just be sure. Nope, okay. Okay, so I finally gave up and just checked to see where the thing is. I mean, I didn't look at a video or anything, but uh... I'll be honest, I still don't fully understand what I'm even supposed to do. I think I have to get to it from like near the beginning of the level though? Oh my gosh, wait a minute, there it is. Okay. It, it was just right there. Oh shoot, wait! Did I- do I still have that? Oh good. I meant to exit level, not quit game. You know, though, while we're at it, and since we're here in the Dreamweavers right now anyway, we might as well try to find that hidden room. <laughs> Definitely not there. Wait, wait a minute. What? Oh. Okay. I saw the camera glitch into that for just a split second. I'm like, oh. Well then, that's another skill point down. Well, time to go take on the boss of this place.
aside from the nightmarish background and like everything, this is surprisingly pretty. Like, you know, the grass and the flowers at least. For what is obviously supposed to be like the deepest nightmare of the friggin' Dreamweavers. go up this way. This pretty much took us right to the boss. I need to go back the other way and get things, though. I'll just go down here first. Or maybe I, maybe I can go like all the way over this way without like doing the thing I normally do. No, this is it right here. Yeah, I would normally just come up like this, basically. Ah, oh, yeah, one of the fools over here lowers that thing. There, it's that particular one. There's a hidden area over here. Releasing me, Spyro. Take care. Now, there is yet another achievement we can get here if we uh, flame all four of these while coming down. Ah. Yeah, I goofed it up. <laughs> There we go. Wait, all the gems they drop fell down, I think. Either that or I collected them before I died. Okay, going good now. Is 
So I like how these raising platforms have like crystals inside of them now. It's a cool addition. before this battle? Advice? Hmm. A wise dragon once told me aim high in life, but watch out for flying boxes. Uh, huh? <laughs> uh -huh. Oh dang, does he throw a little faster in this one? I think he actually might. I mean, there's actually a perfect, you know, there, there, there's a perfect skill point for this guy, which at first I thought was a joke, but I feel like they might have actually slightly upgraded him. Well, I didn't get hit by him, but that was definitely not perfect. Oh wait, if you just chase after him, he barely has a chance to do anything. Maybe he's not that upgraded. Also, you could like, char I think you could charge through his like presence before, but... I'm not going to risk that for this one. Someone feel free to like tell me whether or not you can, but yeah, I wanted the skill point, so I didn't want to risk it. <laughs> well, there we go. Dream Weavers complete. You know, since we're here right now, and since it's literally the last thing we would even have to do in Dreamweavers... Hidden Stump, Hidden Stump. Oh! I see the Hidden Stump right there! Only question is, how do we get to it? <laughs> Maybe we have to supercharge to it? That's a possibility. Oh yeah, that's definitely what you have to do, except I didn't do it right. <laughs> there we go! Oh no, 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 no! Darn it! I should have just tried to charge directly into the stump. There we go! Alright. in store for you. Nasty's world is not the friendliest place you'll ever find. Wait, why was it giving keyboard inputs for a second? Anyway, yes, we're gonna go ahead and uh, go on to Nasty's world.
Kai's world now, Spyro. And you are the dragon that must defeat him. Bring him on. I'm ready. Reach the exit in each of Nasty's lands. Then you can challenge the Nork himself. All right, then. Well, that will be it for this episode. And next time... Yeah, we're going to get started with Nasty's World. So, see you, everyone.